Hey everyone, today I'm excited to try and make this brown butter recipe without burning it. At Lone Goose Bakery, we love providing quality baking ingredients and helping inspire you to bake. The sole ingredient is butter. I've used two sticks here, but you'll want to use an extra half stick due to evaporation loss. As always, the recipe can be found below. Take your sticks of butter and cut each stick into 8 to 10 slices each and place in a saucepan. Using a stove top, heat the butter on medium heat while stirring constantly. Did you know that during the summer, most geese molt or shed their feathers and temporarily can't fly? Keep stirring as the butter bubbles. The color will transition from the characteristic yellow to light brown then darker brown. This process usually takes around 10 minutes, so be patient and keep stirring. This is how the butter looks after heating for 5 minutes. And this is how the butter looks after 7 minutes. Notice how the color keeps getting darker. After 10 minutes, the butter is now brown and has a pleasant nutty aroma. Time to remove from heat and transfer to a heat proof bowl. Don't leave the butter in the pan as it will cause it to burn. You can use this butter immediately or transfer to a fridge for later use. I'm very happy with how this turned out. I definitely didn't burn it, but maybe stopped a bit early. Next time I'll keep it on for an extra couple minutes. I've got this delicious brown butter, but now I need to do something with it. I'm using it in my oatmeal poppy seed cookie video. See you over there.